My name is Sandy Webster. I'm a three-time kidney transplant recipient. I received the first from my father, 1977, the second one from my husband in 1995, and now 13 days ago in 2015, I received the third one from my son. Mrs. Webster's story of having three transplants is very unique uh, in many regards. We do about 200 kidney transplants here a year, 250, and I've been here for well over 20 years, and I don't think I've seen anyone who had three family members before donate, especially the father, the husband, and the son. So it's very unique and very special. I, I knew from about the age of eight that I was going to be a donor. Um, <clears throat> I had expected uh, to donate when I turned 18, and that was always my dream. And things just didn't happen that way. And looking back now, I'm thankful that they didn't. But um, it, things have definitely worked out amazingly. I'm so happy and thankful just to be able to have had the opportunity to not only donate and give my mom such a high quality of life now, but then to be able to carry on the legacy. At this point, you know, it's, it's already the third kidney, so it's, it's quite amazing that, that we're able to do it like that. When I met Sandy, I knew that she had received a kidney from her dad. It was a transplant. You never know in life what life is going to give you or how long you have with anything, life itself. Never thought that she might need a new kidney 20 years later. And, um, but she did, and I consider it an honor and a gift from God for, for me to be able to be the one to give her a kidney. I work as much as I have all the time, and it hasn't made any difference to me just to see them, you know, doing well. And I mean, that's the most important thing. Not many people are uh, fortunate enough to receive uh, three or more kidney transplants. And one of the big reasons is uh, that they can develop antibodies after each kidney transplant. She was very lucky in a way that her son was a match for her, despite having received two kidney transplants in the past. Having received um, a, a living donor is it's hard to explain because what it means for me is um, I didn't need to go on dialysis. You know, so many people are waiting for a transplant. The list is huge. And if you can, if you can get someone to donate to you and eliminate yourself from that list, that others then have their opportunities to get that kidney as well that they've been waiting for, so they can have that quality of life that everybody wants. That's, that's what it's meant to me, personally. Being a living kidney donor is one of the most impactful things you can do as a, as a person, and it's really amazing how much satisfaction the donors get from doing this.